Hello, you beautiful people, and welcome back to Let's Play. Um, I forgot the name now. <laughs> I of course not. And welcome back to Let's Play Warmer. 40k mechanicus in the next round in which we um, generate a little bit of competition for us oh, sorry for my voice there I'm as you might have noticed am still a little tinsy tiny bit um, sick uh, having still a little bit of um, I don't even know whether it was a cold or not but I'm still having a little bit of trouble for example, my voice, um, which obviously <laughs> sounds really terrible, and well, I hope that is going to change very, very soon. And you know that I'm sometimes through it, um, lose my voice. And no, I <laughs> did not party the last couple of days. No, 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 no. Um, all right, I could, I should, I actually really should do that because keep in mind we still have to do another mission. Um, with these guys, so that is the important part. I will just in case move him down here in order to scan there at one point. So you shall move into a position where you are able. You know what I use? Sorry, sorry for the voice there. Yes, we are being shot at for damage. Well, not cool, but in the end, it's going to mean the end of him completely taken out that is nice so you go there and be the end of this bugger so give me your commission thank you all right back to the tech priests which one is it then so you are actually going to move like that do some close combat goodness you know why not I don't know why I always like to say that but in the end that's just it so opportunity they have so I'll just deal a little bit of close combat action I don't know how much damage we did there um, fair enough for now if I'll move there okay no one is actually in range except this guy so let's move here and then put him out of his misery very, very good even gives us some cognition back there that's really really amazing ending him um, could have used you no why okay this guitar trooper I could have repaired. so both of them are a little tinsy bit damaged and one more tech priest is at our command. I'm um, still don't right now how to use him, but at least I can do a few repairs on him. Back up to nine, that is quite nice because I know one thing we are going to use this guy in one of the next battles. Um, definitely one important thing, in my opinion, is that we are trying to get all of the cognition to move on. So um, we have to we have to really think about the next battle, which will come up at one point. So I am in the opinion that we are doing good now. Um, right here, maybe a little bit. Well, should, well, uh, well, well, that was not necessarily, I guess. And I know it does not. It's not the correct way to say necessarily, but anyhow, I just did, mates. All right, I'll am going to take the cognition from there. Want to take as much with me as bloody possible all right that's it for him you are of course going to scan right there even if it's only blackstone but blackstone in the end helps out um, 
sent him right there. And then in the end he can't do much more, I fear. So, I... Okay, I know what's going on. We have one more warrior remaining. I'm going to delay the turns of these two guys. I'm going to end this bugger. If I am, I don't think so. If I would have been in range for this guy, I would have done that. Although, does he do damage? No, only we wield stats. That would have been very, very amazing. So, on one cognition against one cognition. Fair enough there for me. This guy is still available. So, nothing. No cognition remains. What is actually... Of course, that is not working out. Going after his stats, and then I'll take him down. 8 HP is not much, but our two Skitari Rangers, I don't even know what they are called, um, should give him technically, initially, the um, upper hand. Nice, the Dodgers, of course. Um, very important. And now we sh Okay. You didn't completely deal with him. Okay, fair enough. Still, the one guy there remains. Bring him up, up to speed and... Do it, mate. Do it. Bring him down. Nice. Seven damage done. Um, no threat remaining. Nice. So, um, theoretically, um, we did this battle with um, one damage done to us. And that is to a Skatari warrior. That's good. The god has picked up the trail of the offending Flate One pack. It travels through an area of the tomb, choked with debris, where a portion of the tomb has collapsed, making direct pursuit hazardous. Um, we could, of course, demolish clear the area with explosives before moving through it. Fortune, forge on through the dangerous terrain. Fulfilling the mission is worth any risk. Skirt around the area and avoid the danger, though. Um, though it, at the risk of losing the trail, um, let's, oh, alright, demolition charges blast the path within significant delay, but the noise must have alerted the foe to the Korot's presence, no, they should already know we are there, however, little time has lost and several samples can be gathered from destroyed Necron Sacrophagi, alright, um, that's good, that means we go in the last battle of um, this deployment um, with fully healed or nearly fully healed guys and um, a complete gouge of um, cognition points and in my opinion that is very very amazing so sorry there I needed to <laughs> refill my tea pack or oh, I need to fill my tea cup so um, in the end we have to survive five rounds um, battle objectives survive five rounds so technically right now it's only fight once so I uh, will try to use or take some couple of guys in the middle here or at least there um, and the rest is going to stay like here in order to have a full range of fire available against them Necron Flate ones so to speak the uh, uh, um, little problem I see there is that we of course can have a little bit of problem with guys coming from the back so let's see starting the battle right here So this guy is going to move right here, taking the um, point, um, all cognition points, so I'll take all of them, and then I will fire at that, that is a nice shot I think, did a couple, or oh, a little bit of damage there, alright, that was him. Okay, I okay. No, these are just late ones. So good there. Um, so so 
if I'll move him. Well, I can only move him there, so I'll do that. Um, of course, I am going to do something a little like that. We are f at full cognition. Always much appreciated. So, okay, that I'll do. And do you know what? That was absolutely um, amazing. Okay, more of that, please. So that one is down. Um, the thing is, I do not know, of course, where the Necrons are going to spawn overall. So that could be a titsy tiny little bit of problem but anyhow I hope for the best I hope for the best so that was critical nice he's gone so so far it is going quite well but in the end I don't know how long my luck is going to hold up in the end um, I should take care of um, consoles then Oh no, no close, oh well, I don't like close combat, damage absorbed, that is nice. A hit back of course would have been absolutely bloody amazing, so if I go there, nothing important can be hit, so I'll let him move up and help out a little bit down there. So that one is down. Nice, could I fire somewhere else? And that one is not counting right now. So don't think that. So you move up. And do that. Another one down. But I'll help myself. For now just. So this I'm um, disintegrating him. And I'm going to disintegrate. Oh you know he's not in range, okay. Then I don't have much choice. What? Um, additional attack. Allowed it to perform. Did we already do a additional attack? Machines were charged. Okay. But I can't do anything. Anyhow, okay. That was not very good. But can't change it. So if I'll move him right there, I could get one shot out like that. And that did good. That of course did very, very good. You could say just for damage, but well, why not? That was quite good. Okay, ending his turn. So um if I'll move him right there. I could do something cool, I think. If I'll shoot there, then that spreads and that is amazing. And I think that was not bad, because we dealt with multiple Necrons and even put down... Um, and even put down the um, consoles there, so that's good against the Awakening, so to say. So to be honest, in which round are we? Of course, oh my god, now they'll come from behind. So, in the end, I am glad. I'm glad that we moved into the right direction. A little bit in front, so we are, so to say, in the middle. I think that was um, quite nicely done. So I'll move right here and do something a little bit like that. Okay, I... That gun kills them instantly, okay. Um, ending your turn. So only one remains. Does he get in? Oh, poo. I was a little bit afraid there. So I actually want to have him up in front. Um, three rounds only remain, okay. I will finalize him now. So he's no threat anymore. And um, what is, of course, good on this map, okay, I would like to take that, but I can't, um, is that we um, 
have so to say free rain or rain over the necrons so that is quite nice you don't have that very very often so you go there that is a goner um, if I go there I can shoot at both of them and that is what I think I need to do right now taking up the commission so first shot there he's down and you are going to fire right there so that was good I can only move okay I can't completely move but I can move a little bit back But that, guys, right now brings us to the end of this episode, and you know it. I really thank you for watching. If you guys actually have enjoyed this episode, then please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. And, oh god, sorry for the voice again. And hopefully, I'll see you back in the next episode. Until then, have a nice day. Stay frosty.